Tell us what you do from day to day with this canola shell that we're standing underneath. Well, most of the time we're just checking for fuel, making sure everything's all set to ready for the for the drivers to take off with it. So why don't you explain to us the conversion between the diesel fuel and the canola oil? Like what what exactly? Well, it originally starts up on diesel. The front tank is diesel. The rear tank is canola oil. What happens is we start it up on diesel. Once the engine gets to an operating temperature, then it switches to the canola. The canola oil is fed through an aircraft, aluminum aircraft tubing, which is surrounded by antifreeze, which is keeping it from uh, gelling up. And then it runs down to the relay center. Then it switches from diesel to canola at op uh, full operating temperature. It goes through a heat exchange, through the filtration system, around through a secondary filter, through a preheating, and then into the engine. Um, so, and how long does this process take? It takes about 25 minutes because the engine's going to get up to operating temperature. Once it's up at the operating temperature, the computer takes over and then switches it from diesel to the canola oil and then it just runs on straight canola. Oh, so the question is, what is the cost of diesel now and what is the cost of canola oil? Well, diesel fuel at right now is at 253. It used to be at 409 and then the canola oil doesn't cost us anything because it comes from the dining commons.